Uh uh, don't mess with that, Charles. My daddy need what? Mom, my daddy need what? He got his own earphones. He don't need these. Mom. And you don't need those Mom, either. Mom, what are these? Yeah. What's these? Hmm? Mom, what's these? That's the earphones for Monsters Inc. So, Monster. Hey, Mom. Come on, so we don't miss our plane. <gasps> they might be about to leave us. Put it back. Come on. I want this. No, we don't have time. And Daddy got you said already. Um, no, no, no. I got this. I want like this. Oh, wait a minute. Uh-uh. Come here. Mommy. My daddy's My daddy's Charles, Good we didn't come way. here to go shopping. We came here to get on the airplane. Come here. Come here right now. Mom, with this big shirt. Mm-hmm. Come on, let's go find our plane. Put this up. Put this up, Charles. What? No, no, no. Earphones up. Let's go. I got your earphones in my bag. No, uh, uh come here. You can't walk out the store with those. Come here. Uh, uh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. <laughs> he said, "Let them know what we needed to check out." What? You talk about this? No. What? I thought you was gonna get something else. We're not getting earphones. Hey mom, hmm. look at these. These are dogs. No, that's not for a dog. What is it? This is a mom. So is it? Hey mom, what the ID?
It's gonna start going really fast. You seen crisscross applesauce? No. <laughs> now you're not. You were. Then he took his shoes off and say his feet was hurt. Were your feet really hurt? Are you was joking? I just joking. You was just joking. You just wanted your feet out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Say he was joking. Uh-uh, that's no no. Don't push his seat. No, don't push his seat. Don't kick his seat. For me. No, push his seat. No, don't push his seat. No! Here, look up. Be still. Let's see. Okay, y'all, we have finally made it to California and ignore my hair. My husband and my son are out um, just like running errands and stuff. And I decided that I'm going to go to the gym. So I didn't tell y'all what we were doing here, why we came here in the year of the school years, I almost out and all that good stuff. So um, if you don't know, my husband is in the military, he's active duty. And he was deployed for almost a year. And so we came home while he was deployed. So we wouldn't be out here by ourselves. Well, he is back now. He is back. And now um, he needs surgery. He has to have surgery. So we came out here for his surgery. So that is why we came in the surgery schedule for um, May 3rd, which is no may 2nd which is tomorrow so that is what we we are doing out here um and this is like our second home because uh when we got married and moved away we moved to california so we're used to staying out here we're used to the area we're used to you know where we are right now and right now we are in the hotel and we have stayed in this hotel before um so I'm just going to get ready to go to the gym just so I can have something to do because it's not like a lot going on. And then um, they're gonna, my husband and my son are going to spend some time with each other. So that is what we're doing in California. And we finally made it. And I'm so tired. And we just spent the whole day traveling. And I'm so glad it's over with. Like... I, I know people do it all the time, but traveling with a toddler is the, it's not my, I'm going to say it's the absolute worst because we actually did have a great flight. We really did. We had, we um, left from Jackson, Mississippi and went to Houston, Texas. Then our layover was literally, we, were, we didn't have a layover. It was like 45 minutes, but um, if you're, if you're a mom or if you travel with children, you know, you need the stroller. And so we uh packed the stroller and they put it on the plane so you have to wait till it comes off well that takes like 15 minutes of your layover so we by the time we got the stroller and went to the next terminal we had to go all the way to terminal e and if y'all have been to the houston airport y'all know it's humongous we had to catch the tram all the way to the uh terminal e finally got the terminal e it had to go to gate 22 all the way down so by the time we got there everybody was on the plane they were still boarding but most everybody was on the plane which is kind of good because it, it is no downtime for my son to just be kind of waiting and getting restless and that's that that's not what he needs he needs to always be doing something because he's a toddler he is like 
his motivation is to move and so if he's moving he's good but if we're stagnant and standing still that's no no bueno so we finally got here and the weather is kind of cold i thought it was going to be uh, much warmer than what it is but i did pack some workout clothes so i am going to go work out as soon as they get back and then uh we're probably not even doing much tonight we're probably not doing anything tonight um because we're so tired and uh, I don't know. I don't know why I'm tired, but I'm going to the gym. I feel like I need to go because I haven't been to the gym. And I feel like this is just something that I could do. I could be productive and do. And so that's what I'm going to do. But we're going to be out of school. Um, my son and I, I'm going to be out of school for um, seven days from the 1st to the 5th. Then the 7th to the 9th. I'll be back on the 10th. So I'm not going to see my little angels for quite some time i'll be back next wednesday but um you know you do what you have to do for family you do what you have to do to make sure everybody's safe and healthy and and prospering and just living well and so i have to make sure my family is taken care of before i can just necessarily um go teach school all day every day and not think about what's going on in my household so um my husband is going to have his surgery in the morning and i'm sure everything's going to go great no problems and then road to recovery and then we can just move on from there but i just wanted to like check in with y'all because i feel like um i feel like let me turn this way i just want to check in with y'all because i feel like i just decided to just Come on, let's just go to California and then tell y'all why. But on that note, I think I'm going to start doing some um, other videos besides teacher-related videos on my channel because I am a mom, I am a wife, I am a military spouse. I, it's so many angles to me that I think I'm going to try to incorporate all of that in my channel and so... Um, my God, especially since it's summer coming up, I'm not going to be doing a lot of teacher stuff because I'm not working this summer. I'm not teaching summer school. I don't plan on teaching summer school. And um, it's, it's going to be more of a relaxed summer for us. And so hopefully it's, hopefully it'll be a relaxed summer. And so I plan on trying to incorporate other um other aspects of my life into my channel. So I think that'll be good. I think that'll be cool. Um, this is my little workout outfit. This is what we wearing today. I don't know why this looks so tight. It don't look tight on in person, but it looks tight on on this camera. I don't know when I do it on the camera. So yeah, this is my workout outfit. Just a, I don't know, like a pullover. I don't even know, probably Walmart or somewhere, maybe Old Navy. And then some uh gray tights or leggings, whatever y'all call them. And then I am going to wear my tennis shoes, of course. But um, I'm not going to put those on until they pull up and I head out. Um, I just wanted to kind of come in and check in with y'all. So, excuse the madness, the the travel hair, and the no makeup. Man, actually, I'm okay with no makeup most of the time because I'm just like... Oh, ain't got to do nothing, you know, but um, I do like dressing up and getting fancy and all that kind of stuff. But traveling, no, nah, comfort overrules all of that. So if we're traveling, I'm I'm comfortable. I'm, I'm comfortable. I'm chilling. So anyway, talk to y'all later. Bye.